Okay, so I'm about to record my Windows 10 to 7 video. Well, I've recorded the installation months ago. Yes. <clears throat> but the problem is that not the software and not the link and any other, but it's the hardware itself. And it's, I've already been, I don't know, like updating this on Twitter, like, months and months and times so hmm let's see this we got a normal looking what you want to call it normal looking monitor somehow all right so maybe i just save this as a jpeg in order to get it sorted all right so it's about to save and it's open on another monitor, which is... What? <laughs> My reaction is like that. I'm going to full screen. Where is the full screen? Oh, there it is. Alright, so... We've got the full screen right here. It looks fine for a black color for a monitor. But if we switch... To the second monitor, well, not really the second, but the third one. Alright, so here it is. It is completely fine. I mean, it's actually very cool. But, if we started to move it on a third monitor, things just got out of hand. It got really worse. I mean, come on. Like, the color just... The monitor just burned so hard. If you look at... If you look on the Twitter, it, it just, I don't have many words to describe this with. It, it's got, like, the color just, it's not pure black. It, it's got white and burning colors and stuff, which, honestly, it really bothers me for months and months and months. Well, you don't, you don't look at when it's in the color, like, if you don't have any black color or, like, dark color, on the monitor it looks fine it actually really looks fine but if it started to make it up to very black or like dark color it really bothers me I mean come on I just it may maybe I've used it for 12 years or 11 years because I remember I'm started using this monitor on my old XP PC which by the way, I still have it on my attic, and, um, yeah, it turns out it's a bad idea to use a very old monitor continuously through 11 or 12 years. So, maybe the last option will be have to replace this into another 4x3 monitor, or, well, the best case scenario, maybe... I'll buy a 1080p monitor because I'm, well, this monitor looks completely fine, actually, it's good, but it's 1366 by 768, which Nova Tiberium says, what a fucking old school, why is it still on 768p? Yeah, I, I kind of agree on that, but laptops came out with 1366 by 768, even until now. Or, well, even, like, even smaller, like 720p, pure 720p, whilst other media standardize this, their self as, well, they set 1080p as standard quality, even though, well, standard for HD, 720p, even on YouTube, it says not even HD anymore, it's, like, it's HD, it's not that, it's just completely standard definition for 720p even though i don't like three or four years back it's still classified as hd so i'm going to maybe say rip <laughs> rest in piss forever miss for this kind of monitor maybe i'll update it on twitter once i got a new monitor or something when my channel got monetized so i can get my own money not instead of like saving for years and years and there is no such a result
And by the way, like the confidential project, well, y'all cannot see this channel unless you are in the confidential team. So Sulfur is working on the music and the script, like collecting all the builds and also like, um, yeah, he got the music right there about like the background music used for the documentary. I mean, talk about like what are the YouTubers that are going to be in the project and confidential poll. So this is an early poll for the project. So this says which of these names are more worthy to be the title of this series. Well, seems like a lot of people chose the number nine, which is the history of Windows. And I don't think that's a great idea because I've used that for the history of Windows 11. So I think I have to um, choose the second option, but the problem is that there are three votes for. The sixth one is a tribute to Windows, which I actually choose. The eighth option, the Windows story, and the ten is codename Windows. Well, Sulfur just said, like, yesterday, He's saying like, why don't the title just be Windows? Just the word, just one word, Windows. Well, I kind of agree on that, but the problem is that you don't really get too creative and just title Windows. And what length is more appealing? It says 25 to 30 minutes, which is got the more vote. And 35 to 40 minutes, which is the other option right there. And next one, should there be more footage or more segments from YouTubers? I remember there are only just more footage, but now they for more segments. And should the series feel more a podcast or a show? Okay, they think it's a show. And should there be a post credit scene for each episode, only selected episode? They chose all of us, which I have to brainstorm. Well, not I, but the team have to brainstorm what should be included on the post credit scene for each freaking episodes and well okay it's got fine and the confidential team let's see the team myself as the director and a lot of people are working on this well not a lot of people but it's still quite a lot for such a like fan-made project so Hands up to all of them and heads off for all people who dedicated their time to build such a project that I really ambitioned since 2020, I think. Well, if you know, like, the A Masterpiece by Thing Media Inc., well, which is now is private the video, it actually is the project, but the problem is that the script is very bland and unstructured so i have to cancel the project so the, here it is the more revised one after like the history of windows 11 video the script is more finalized and more refined so let's see the now process on august 16th to 2022 there's nothing completely like nothing to work Aside from the pr script writing for Windows 1.0, like the pre-Windows 1.0, and Windows 1.0x. And let's just see, there's nothing completely in works right now. And, well, let's take a look at some teasers. I myself going to be in a project, of course, because it's on my channel, so why I wouldn't be on the channel. And Advantage A, of course, is going to be in Nova Tiberium. Yes, they're like kind of in. Ficube always on for the project. Everything AB or Ibrahim is going to be in a project, of course. He said that. Kweku and XT is going to be in a project also. He gave some positive reply and feedback for the project. Orbitron always says, I'm in. Billy O'Reilly, this is kind of a surprise, he said, Oh, I'm very appreciated by your project. Sulfur is always, even he said, If you have anything to voice over with, just contact me. And he's in, of course. Malwarepad, which, if you all don't know, Malwarepad is just like, 
a YouTuber, like, not really a big YouTuber, but a YouTuber who made some malware videos and experiment videos, like, kind of like Enderman, but he tried to distance their self for, uh, from Enderman, but still having that vibe to it. It's, it's like, I actually... <laughs> I actually have some OS first kind of vibe, but I try to distance myself because I don't want to like, like a an OS first time I want to be, but I just only want to integrate some OS first time feels into my channel, and NT Dev, which to my surprise, he's in, and I said, I've already like prepared the project thoroughly. Do you think it's really prepared thoroughly? And NT Dev said yes. It's very thoroughly. So now it doesn't have that much into project, but aside from I'm going to replace my monitor with something completely better. Yeah, <laughs> I think it's quite a thing. All right. Now I'll see you in the next video of Awin Chaotic Vlogs. See you next time. Bye.